Oh wow. This whole place feels like one giant half-life level. It does, doesn't it? My torch is rubbish. This is really bad. I can't see anything. I really don't want to fall in that, you know. There's um, a lot of pigeons in there. Really? There's a lot of Loads pigeons. Of them. Really? I've got to see that. Show me the pigeons. Where are the pigeons? Yeah, little pigeons. Oh my word. Right. So their exhaust gases came out of here and then went out of these holes, which would have had blast valves over them. And so there's a bulkhead there, which would have separated the inside of the site from the outside. That's a fairly sizable valve. Yeah, that, that entire thing was a blast valve. Well, I'm going to get out of here because this pigeon dust is disgusting. <coughs> What's that? What is that noise? This is the floor. It's on springs. Yeah. Yeah, the old vinyl has the best of Oh, wow. Yep. Whoa. Let's not fall in there prematurely. Yeah, it looks pretty gross. This one, yeah, this one is really murky. Are we not actually going in something not too dissimilar? Mm, pretty much. Wow. Holy cow. <laughs> so what's this? What are we looking at? This is the the what? The antenna silo. The antenna silo. How solid is this? I can't really see it. Narrowly escaping death at every turn. This is... This is Earth after a zombie apocalypse. And you know what I've learned? I've learned that after a zombie apocalypse, transport is surprisingly difficult and dangerous. And there's no concern for basic health and safety. That's metal. That's metal? This metal is just breaking apart. Ooh! I do not want to get in that. Ah. Yep, I really should keep my eye on the ceiling. Notice that kind of sulfur smell in this area. Sorry, what gas? Hydrogen sulfide. And it's that does poisonous. Okay. Let's move on. Past the poisonous gas. Oh, okay. There's another one around this area. I think the brown recluse is definitely to be avoided. What's the brown recluse do? Brown recluse is uh, one of the ones that uh, basically creates a necrotizing effect in the venom spot, so... Which means? Uh, it basically just kills the tissue and it leaves a huge and horrible scar if it doesn't kill you. Oh, okay. That's good. We'll try and avoid those. Yeah, I 